Hello there, mortals. Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to my viewers around the world. Thank you for tuning in. And for those who are new to my channel, welcome. This is the sixth episode of Yes, Your Grace. And we're going to end our turn here. And we're going to use the money that we borrowed from the bank to buy fabrics for our daughter's wedding and hire a band. And we're left with this much. Uh, bank, right. Bank gold payment, 10. So our taxes now, let's see, it's 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18. So we're going to get eight gold per turn after paying off the bank right so we gotta make sure we oh this this one here so we're losing one goal right the next turn because we sent out our general oh it takes goal okay okay so we have one week until our wedding we managed to buy everything which will be great so let's get on with the gameplay of week eight What's going on? The queen wanted to see you, your grace. Alright. General? No signs of the Redovians at the east post, your grace. There was nothing left behind. Very good. We got everything. We cleared everything here already. We can't explore. Can we? No, we can't the moment all right lady ida your grace you called for me remind me what did the thief look like the merchant you spoke of what was he wearing again he was wearing a dirty cream apron a dark green shirt and a hat thank you now i have found your thief I have put the man in the in the dungeons where he belongs. Your Grace, if I may, can I take him with me? Of course, do whatever you may desire with him. Don't worry, Your Grace. I will show him where his place is. And of course, you can count on my help during your upcoming battles. I don't have much to offer, but it's better than nothing. I'm glad we became allies, Lady Ida. It's good to have you on our side it's my pleasure that's all yeah all right we got 60 more men to our army if you need anything let me know when you make alliances the alliances name will turn green and then but when you upset some lords their name will turn red this usually means you can't ally with them anymore okay Can we call on King Tally? Mm hmm. Okay. Let's see who's next. Pedro. Your Grace, I'm starting to think that perhaps you are involved. What I'm saying, why would I say this? Why would you tell someone you know that they know? I better leave. I can leave, right? That's a weird, weird boy. Oh, my daughter. Father. Lucilia, you finally came out. Can you please come and meet me at the wall when you have a chance? I wanted to talk to you. Of course, I'll see you there. Peasant, step forward. Bow before your king. Your grace. I came here to ask you for help. My father is very sick with fever. Please help me, please. He is pale as a ghost and he shakes and sweats all the time. We have tried treating the fever with cold water and postalize of butter, onion and garlic. We have given him a concoction of wormwood and mint. We even tried letting the bad blood with leeches. Yeah. I'm afraid he might not last another night. Your Grace, if we had a witch 
If we had a court which available, she would handle these diseases. That's true. You could put out a word that we were looking for one. As for your father, we do have this medicine, right? Try looking for a healer. Take. I have this medicine. This should help your father. It's something stronger. And you wouldn't find on the ru ru euro. Euro stalls. Really? That's probably will help. Thank you, Your Grace. Papa, here I come. Really? No update? With the Radovian poses gone, I think we are ready for the wedding, Your Grace. Yes. Yes, we are. Okay, let's see. Who needs my attention? Within the castle walls. Alright, guys. Let's see. Where should we go? Counselor's chamber? Gardens. Let's go to the gardens. Yes, father. We're almost ready for the wedding. It looks like it's going to be quite a banquet. Yeah, for you it will, not for Lorsulia. I still can't believe she's leaving. Hopefully she can learn to be friends with Prince Ivo. I don't think she wants to. I know, I wish we had more time to find a prince, but this is the way it has to be. There's something else here. What are you doing? You're a king. <laughs> Keep your voice down, pumpkin. Are you ready for the wedding? Yes. I just had one question I must ask you, Grace. Yes? May Smudgy come to the wedding too? Well, I guess. But you need to keep him very close to you. I will always keep him close, Your Grace. Fine, he can come. Don't forget to say goodbye to Lord Sulia when she's leaving right after the wedding. Yes, I also need to say goodbye to Dusty. It's gonna be alright, Pumpkin. Okay, I guess we need to... Let's talk to the wife first, before we talk to the daughter. Anna. Darling? Uga. Everything is ready, apart from one last thing. Choosing a dress. I'll let you do the honors. Oh. Hmm. I like this center one. This one's a bit too puffy. This one, the hand gloves look like some sort of leather gloves. I think it's this one. This is the middle ground gown. Nothing special, but for 25 gold pieces, we can't expect too much. What do you think? The puffy one, yes? 25 gold, let me think. The puffy one. <laughs> How about this one? Uh, this is obviously not an option. I found this in my chest of my old clothes. It even smells. Ooh. It, it won't cost a coin, but what do you think? What would everyone else think? So, the puffy one. <laughs> Zero go. Okay. Yes, look no further, further than this one right here. This one. Puffy one. Oh, look at this puffy decorated piece of art. Isn't it beautiful? 50 gold is nothing for such elegance. What do you say then? This is the one, right? This is expensive. This dress is nice, but... Oh, don't worry about the cost. The bank said they will help us fund this dress. So it's almost free. How does that work exactly? Oh, I don't know. They will spread the cost or something? Don't worry about it. It won't cost us anything until the wedding is over. Ooh. What to do, guys? What to do? Get the expensive wedding gown. Your wife is happy. 
you bear with the expenses. Huh. Actually, I like this one. Yeah, th this one was more elegant, right? More classic. Hmm. Well, let's just take the plunge and see what happens, right? Let's get the puffy one. I wouldn't skim on my daughter's wedding. Yeah, that's... I mean, I wouldn't skim on my daughter's wedding, but... Let's give it a go. Yes, Lucilia is gonna love this one. And we don't have to pay anything. Well, at least for now. How are you holding up? I'm so happy. Our daughter is marrying a prince. A prince, not a barbaric Romanian. I knew everything would turn out fine. Okay, I'll see you later. Fine, I'll stay here. Alright, let's talk to our daughter. At the wall. Hopefully she's alright. Oh, it's you. You wanted to see me? I'm sorry I shouted at you, father. I didn't mean it when I called you stupid. I wish things were different. I just wish I spent the past couple of days being with you, not angry at you. I know, darling. I know. I love you, father. I love you more than anything in this world, Luli. Hugs. I know. You hate it when I call you that, but you're still my Luli. It's alright, Papa. I miss you calling me. Your mother has prepared one hell of a wedding. Yes, I better get ready before she finds me. I'll see you at the party. Dusty? Good boy. That's a good boy. Alright, guys. Looks like the wedding preparations are all ready. And we have to speak with the other king. At the counselor's chamber. King Tallies. How's your wife? Haven't seen Paloma in years. Does the illness persist? Why are you so curious about her? Yes, she is still sick. Otherwise, I wouldn't even be here. But like I already told you, it's none of your business. I wonder if that medication that we gave just now could have helped with his wife. What's going on in Atania? Yes. Yos and Barovia resolved their wars here. What? They were still fighting about again? Land? Wishcraft? I don't know. I don't care to find out. I have my own problems. Is everything alright in Hargos? I've always wanted to visit your beautiful town. Why don't you go and see for yourself what it's like better than this rat hole? Mm -hmm. I'd like to know a little about your son before you know the marriage. What's there to say? Evo has royal blood, and I pay enough for his masters to ensure that he's at least half as smart as I am. Can't you just leave me alone? I'm trying to focus here. Did you find anything yet? Are those books of any use? Healing fever, how to prevent something about malaria, all of this are useless. Hmm. We're almost ready for the wedding. We booked the forest. I bought these throne decorations. We have a live band. There's no need for that. I just want it to be over with, done with. Who cares about the stupid decorations? It's the vows that are important. I hate weddings. People forget what they are really about. Uh, well. It's going to be quite a party either way. I'll see you there. Yes, very well. He's such a party pooper. I don't really like him. Alright, guys. Let's... I guess... Yep. 
this is it for this episode. If you guys want to catch the wedding, stay tuned for part 7. Episode 7. We're going to be having a grand wedding. And thanks for tuning in, guys. The story is unfolding quite well. Uh, our daughter is getting married. We bought an expensive fluffy dress that we couldn't afford but we did eventually just to keep the household happy I guess you can say I hope you guys enjoyed this thanks again and until next time I'll reap you later